everyone and welcome to today's video. Today I'm gonna make my hair. <laughs> so I have got my Mr. Smith pink, like a mask, it's a strawberry blonde mask. Now it is Peter certified. Peter doesn't just put their certification on any products. They are very diligent to make sure that no animals were harmed in the process, both when it comes to the testing on animals and animal products inside cosmetics and products. So I've already done this once before. It's supposed to last between four to eight shampoos. Now because my hair is very, very bleached, my hair sort of lasted more like eight to 10 shampoos. It was quite a while. The longer you leave it in, the pinker your hair will be when you wash it out. So if I just put it through and I only leave it in for a couple minutes, or if I first have a shower, towel dry it and then put a bit in and then wash it out, it's gonna be a really soft pink. But what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make it quite vibrant pink. So I'm gonna put it in completely dry. I'm gonna put heaps in and I'm actually gonna leave it for a while before I wash my hair. And I'm also going to dress myself up after I've got my pink hair. I'll do my hair. I've got some pink jewels that I found in the op shop yesterday. Can you see that? So here we go. And I love that it can just be washed out. It's not permanent. And it's also like a mask for your hair. So it's really hydrating and good for it. It's not like um, bleach or other colors that you might put through it. So I've got my Mr. Smith brush as well, which has got nice, thick spaces between the bristles, which means that it doesn't sort of, won't pull at the hair as much and it's just much nicer to brush your hair. Two to three minutes, then rinse. So I have put it in completely dry. <laughs> um, my hair wasn't wet, so it's gonna be super freaking pink. All right, I should probably go and wash it out now. You guys want to join me in the shower? <laughs> All right, let's go. Alrighty, so there you can see it is really pink. It feels really soft and silky as well, which is nice. I'm normally really good at not necessarily getting my face wet if I've got makeup on, but. I looked down at one point and forgot that I was filming a video and now I've got water down my face. Ooh, okay, so now time for rollers. It feels so soft. Cause it is a mask, like I said, it's a, it's a good treatment for your hair. The other thing, how strong your pink will be depends on your blonde hair. So if you've got bleached blonde hair like mine, that's quite porous. It's gonna take in a lot of that pigment, which it has done, which is why it's so vibrant. Um, but like I said, it depends when you put it in. If you put it in wet, if you put it in your hair dry, how long are you leaving it in for? Um, so there's quite a bit of flexibility in that regard. Alrighty, there we go. So I'm gonna leave it in. I'm gonna check back with you guys in a few hours once it's all dry and ready to style into place. So here we go, here's the final look. I've put the sparkles on. I, I just opted for a really nice, simple black top and I've got the little sparkles in the ears too. So there's the pink all drawing in together. Now I was just wondering about the hair, whether or not I should put it up so it's more like this. Or I could do something cute like that. Maybe I'll do something cute like that. 